Yeah, you know, it's my off day and I'm just kicking it. I'm getting addicted to my NBA more than anything right now. Got drafted to the Blazers and we're playing the Celtics right now. Career mode, you know, it's cool. And enters Y2 Dave. Y2 Dave. Now I just saw Quincy put a video of an ad. I don't care what Ron Burgundy puts up. He's not even following protocol. Till he follows protocol, I'm just going to sidestep his videos, okay? The Raw GM said to send the videos to him. Mr. Quincy Jones, you're not bigger than anybody else, buddy. Get to sending the videos to the RWR GM. It's just that simple. Now, fast forward. Let's get away from Ron Burgundy. We're going back to Y2 Dave. Raw is David Cole, baby. He's off a tour and he's ready for action. Who does he pick? He picks the guy that, yeah, I've shown schizophrenic, you know, uh, characteristics. I've heard voices. I've made my voice sound like this. Uh, you called it Morgan Freeman. That was great. You know what? I like that. I like you, Dave. I really do. But let's get something straight here. You didn't let me beat you. Now, I'll admit, that wasn't your best. I felt like that was pretty weak from you. I've seen better. I know you got better in you. So, bring that on Friday. Plain and simple. I don't care what the topic is. I don't care what the time is. long as your ass is there, my ass is going to be there. In that ring, SmackDown main event. Dave versus Tazzo, me. Now, I know it may be kind of hard for you guys to say, how could Zoe just give up on the RWR title and lose it in six days and all this kind of stuff? Listen, when I say it was part of the plan, it was part of the plan. Can Will beat Quincy? Hell yeah. I know he'll beat him. 100% confident in William beating him. Now, would I have beaten him? He may have got away with it. He may have got the RWR title for me. But we've gotten away from what the RWR was supposed to represent. Oh, I got to pause it. My guy's back in now. We've gotten away from what the RWR was supposed to represent to begin with. It's to, it's to entertain. It's to represent change. Radical wrestling. Remember that? The whole radicals things. You know, we were supposed to be the radicals. Oh, Chris Benoit, Dean Malenko, Perry Saturn, so on and so forth. Eddie Guerrero, the legend. Dave, you got too much back and forth banner with me, buddy. Now, granted, we have our match on Friday. And after I beat you, that's probably not going to be the only time. Or you're not going to quit making your videos referencing me. And that's okay. I get it. It's chemistry there. But make no mistake about it, Dave. I'm going to beat you. I'm going to beat you again. No, we haven't seen Zach. I miss Zach. Hey, Zach. He's a good guy. I had a lot of back and forth banter with him. And I'm seeing a resemblance in that with you, Mr. Jericho. Or Y2 Dave, excuse me, not Jericho. I know, but I know Fozzie is off of tour. I watched your Twitter. You know, I follow you on Instagram. I like some of the pictures, buddy. It's great. But come Friday, you might as well get ready to go back on to tour. All right? That's all I got to say. I'm going to finish my game now. Quincy, you worry about Will. This head right here, it's not even thinking about you. It's thinking about a guy that's in West Virginia or... Ohio or wherever the hell Dave is now. I don't know. He, he's everywhere. You look at the notifications where he's from when you get messages on Facebook. Gilbert, stay out of my way. Lawrence is waiting on you, buddy. Trust me. Gilbert and Tazo will happen. Just wasn't happening today. All right. Now, I'm going to go back to my game. 
RWR, I give you the John Cena salute. Deuces. <laughs>